Yo guys, Shadow Gaming here, and today I'm back with some more AR vs SMG series, episode 7 with the H3K. Now, in this game, I'm going to be showing you me using the, SV um, the H3K, sorry, my bad, on Domination Nuketown. Now, I've been talking about this in previous videos about me using um, the H3K, the Weevil, and the Razorback. Now, I did three videos the other day back to back, all f all in a row, literally just straight up. I woke up, I went on game with the H3K, the 94, and I don't even know how many deaths I get at the end of this. I've watched this game for like two or three times. I've had pro I've actually had problems trying to do this upload. Every time I'm trying to edit it or anything, my voice the voiceover just doesn't either the voiceover doesn't reckon like it doesn't finish. Um, it, like it, I don't I don't I can't really explain it. Um, this is a really lucky like I've never ever played a start of of a domination game or a hotpoint game and ever got one of my streaks. Like I can't even well, I have before obviously, but I just can't remember the last time. I usually always die. Some idiot just always comes out of nowhere and gets me. Uh, I get really lucky here, there's a amount of times I almost die, and then there's this one silly part here, look. Uh, not this bit, so I survive all of this, and then I... Wait for it. And then I die to that. I wasn't even meant to be getting shot there, I got shot through my teammate getting shot from another guy who didn't even see me. So um, that was potentially me getting my wraps, which would have made this definitely 100 kill gameplay if I got my streaks that early. So yeah, that's quite unfortunate right there. But yeah, I've never really played a full start of the game without... So I, d I never know where to go. I always try to change it up. Whenever it's half point, I don't like to go to straight to the half point. Sometimes I do. If I'm, if I'm, I don't know if my accuracy is just on point. If if I go straight to half point, sometimes no one's even there. If I go straight to red cards, usually they're all at the half point and they just end up getting me. It's really, I don't, I just never know what to do. And, so, and I'm really surprised that I actually got to B flag, like straight up after about 10 seconds into the game and didn't even die. So yeah, it was quite cool. I got a, um, I got a nine man yesterday with with the Tempest. Well, actually, I got eight with the Tempest, and then after I got one more with the um, Man of War. I was using a Man of War class. It wasn't actually my original, it isn't my, like, my proper Man of War class for pub stomping. It's actually the one with the Semtex. It's, it's this class here, actually. It's pretty much the same class as this, but I just swapped the gun around. Just like what I did with the Weevil and the Razorback, pretty much. So, yeah. I have... I've, re I've redone episode 4, the Weevil episode. I've redone that episode because it didn't make any sense. Be well, it did make sense, but I, I, it never showed me fully getting over 70 kills in that in that video. So it, it's me. It felt like cheating, and I didn't fully, I didn't fully, um, I didn't, like, I didn't feel comfortable by it, and I didn't fully think that you guys would understand or even believe that I got that amount of kills in the game. I did get 85 at the end of it, but it does cut out. So yeah, that's the Atomo fucking up with me. So I just got another one. That I, I think, I don't know whether, I don't know, 100% I don't even know what I'm better with, ARs or SMGs at the moment. I do, I actually, I'm starting to come to the side of think this, I really fuck up here, okay? Excuse that one, just pretend you haven't seen that. But, um, I do, I am coming to the side of thinking that I'm actually better with ARs. I mean, there's two ways we're going to solve this by the end of it. It's going to be by opinion, and it's going to be by amount of kills and, uh, kills to death ratio. So I'm also going to go back and count it after, but I think, so far... Well, not I think. I am in the lead with the ARs. But, I mean, there are more, so that is the big disadvantage. So, there's the Man of War, which I got 97. There's the VMP, which is a failed episode, which it didn't make, uh, it cut out as well, but that was a long time ago. And back when I did that, back in the start of June, which was like six weeks ago, I think. Six weeks ago tomorrow, or something like that. So uh, just over a month, almost a month and a half. That's how long ago I did that VMP video. And I, at that time, I didn't even actually make the rules permanent, so they weren't, there wasn't even correct rules there was literally just me trying to upload a gameplay so you can see my gun skill but then now I've up, I've made the rules for the challenge so it, it becomes harder and you have to get certain kills so it's actually harder so I have to actually use the gun or I have to show that I'm actually good with the gun so in order for that I, I mean now that I've got the VMP video n not now that I've got now I realize that that VMP video actually doesn't even show many kills I kind of do not know how to. Do, I might have to do another VMP video as well. I don't know yet. I'm not 100% certain. I may not because it was a long time ago and it wasn't actually. There was there was no rules at the time. I didn't actually make the rules permanent, so I don't really know if that's what I'm gonna be doing. But but the, this is on 94, Man of War 97, Shiva's 112, and the M8 was on I think 80 something. So overall, that's almost two, uh, 300, 400. So, the SMGs are a distinct disadvantage at the moment, so I don't really know what to do with that. Because the VMP video just pretty much just doesn't doesn't cover up for all the videos itself. Like usually that, is, that was going to be my, my best gun, that was going to be my best video. Because the VMP is my favourite gun, or was my favourite gun for a long time in the game. 
Uh, I still use I still use it in in CW or you know UMG games like competitive stuff. I still use that gun all the time. Or the CUDA. I'm really surprised I haven't done the CUDA video yet either. That the Razor Packs come before that because the CUDA at the time I started playing this game, it was just me using the the um, VMP every single game, every single time. Uh, obviously, aside from me trying to get diamond on all the guns to get dark matter, but I mean at the time I was literally just going for. I was just using um. If, I don't know if you can hear that. That's my dog being really weird. My God, he sounds. That's him howling. Or I don't know what he's doing. I would say that's him howling, but that's him doing that because he's really horny and wants to hunt my dog, who's a girl, but he's a boy, and um, she's in season. So yeah, just thought I'd hear that. But yeah, what's called the VMP? I used that a lot at the start. It was literally my favorite gun. It's what I became really good at this game with. It was that's where my SMG skill started on this game. I've always been good at using SMGs. My favorites. That's obviously like that's my strong point in using the game. I've pretty much just always used uh, SMGs and stuff, I've just always been a sub player. But I've started to use um, uh, ARs a lot more, and especially in the this, in this series. The this series has really helped me out get better with it. This is where it gets really annoying, I almost double up my streaks which has been really cool, but this one guy comes out nowhere with a banshee, he just hopped out over, uh, over the top of me, I didn't even realise. But yeah, if I got that, that would have been insane as well. But I reckon in this game, if I really did, did not fuck up on that streak at the, there and the streak at the start, and I think I almost, I fuck up somewhere in the middle between that as well, I probably, I reckon I could have almost got 150 kills in this game, not even over exaggerating. I got 94, I've had 130 before with the M8 and that wasn't even the, the I actually know it was a really good gameplay. But this seriously was going really well. Um, I started clutch, uh, not clutching, but I started picking up a lot more kills towards like, this towards this half, which is really good. Um, so yeah, that is kind of what I, th I would have been happier with. Well, I mean, not happy with, obviously I'm happy with 94, it's my first game with HVK on. But I did actually play a few more games before this, so it wasn't actually my first game using HVK in a long time. I was actually play yesterday, I well, the, the day before I actually uploaded this was about s seven games with this, with Ryan. Seven or eight games with this gun, and then eventually I actually got a good one with this. This gun's pretty, like, the fire rate on it is just too high, I c it's hard to get used to. The fire rate's too high and it makes makes the gun really accurate, uh, inaccurate, so... As you can see here, the Semtex kills, well as you know, the car blew up, but still I'm trying to go for Semtex kills for that challenge, the 100% completion on the challenges. So that's why I'm pretty much using Semtex all the time. I don't even use Tacticals and Lethals at, at all, I, well I've never used them up until 5 days ago, 6 days ago. So, like in the, in the last video I think you've seen me doing on this series with the Shiva, I was using frag grenades, trying to get 3 inch kills with frag grenades, I've done that. I'm on 290 or 285 of the Semtexes. Now I've got to use all trip mine stuff like that. I don't, yeah, I don't want to, but yeah. This is me trying to try and destroy that as well, because uh, obviously I'm trying to go for streaks. If you guys, oh yeah, it's, there's a challenge trying to get on 100%. You have to destroy a Raps deploy ship within like five, se four seconds, I think it is. So when you when you hear enemies deploying Raps deploy ship, in, you have to be able to destroy the Raps deploy ship within the time it drops. It can't drop one. So. That means you have to, so if you were to do it with a black cell, because you can't obviously do it with the X-53, because wraps take four, I think it's four or five rockets, but um, it, it takes like one second to load in the launcher, and then one second to lock on and shoot, or maybe even two, so it's pretty much impossible to do it with that. You have to do it either with either the Tempest or the Scythe, I don't know which one's better, so I've been pretty much using this Scythe, uh, this Tempest to try to do it. Every time they've, d they've, the chance of them ever deploying a wraps deploy ship in is so unlikely, because I never really come across anyone who actually gets one, and they just come out of care package. And when they actually do one out of the care package, it never even, full, it never even like I never get it. Every, either the enemies have deployed it too early and I haven't even got my tempest ready. It's not even fully charged. It's about a kill away. Or every time I deploy my my tempest and about to go shoot it down, I can't find it or I get killed just while doing it. So pretty much, I'm never. It's going to take me a long time to get that challenge. And the challenge that I think I'm never going to do is the. EMP grenade, the e power core. You have to destroy five enemy power cores. I've only ever literally come across one in my last, like, since I can remember playing this game. I've only ever come across one enemy who has ever used a power core against me. Uh, right on. I could have got a quad feed right here and killed them all myself, but I was trying to get a quad feed with a grenade, as you guys sent text kills. But um, yeah, I've, I've only ever come across one guy since I can remember who has ever used a power core against me, and that was uh, two days ago. And I can not, I cannot get to it. We was getting spawn trapped like fuck, um, and I just literally couldn't get across map to it, and it really pissed me off. But that's, I think that's the one challenge I'm gonna have really bad trouble on. The other one's just gonna take me a while. The other one's gonna take me a while. But um, yeah, this is this is pretty much the temp. This is pretty much me using tempest all the time because of that reason. It is just I, I, st I don't know whether I prefer the tempest or the scythe even. It's I don't know whether you guys can say that. Might have to do something on the specialist for you guys. I don't really know. But um, yeah, this is 94 at the end. I don't really know if 
how you guys feel about this this one because it does vary. Sometimes I do really shit with it. But I don't know. I don't know what the, my overall deaths is at the end. But yeah, it comes to it's coming to an end in a second. But what's called the next the I don't even know when the M8 video is going to be the part two one. But I don't really know when it's going to be uploaded. But it's probably going to be right at the end of the series. I'm almost certain now. Otherwise, it just doesn't make sense because obviously the odds and evens are different. So the evens, yeah, again, are. The evens are the the SMGs and the odds are the assault rifles, so I don't really know whether I should stay. Stay. I don't really know if I should keep the M8 video to last or put it in somewhere. It wouldn't just make sense because if I put it after after an SMG video, it would just go. Ju it'd be two AR videos in one go. Or if I put it with the AR video, it'd just be two AR videos again. So there's not really a way of getting around it. So I don't really know what to do yet. But it will come out soon. And I think this is pretty much where all the kills just dry out. There's no more kills pretty much anymore because we've just. We almost dominated them for a while, but uh, that was pretty much it. And that is the HPK gameplay. The, there's a Dying Light video coming out t tomorrow. No, no, it came out on the weekend. There's gonna be another one coming out next Saturday because I thought I'd try out something different other than just COD on the channel. But that's going to be on Saturday, next Saturday. I hope you guys did enjoy that one on Saturday. It was just quite weird, different to where everything else I've uploaded. But um, that's pretty much it. <laughs> this is going to be the end of the gameplay right there. I think I show it right now. Yeah, there you go. 94 to 27. Don't know how you guys felt about that one, but anyways, thank you guys for watching. If you have enjoyed this video, do not forget to like, comment, subscribe. It does help me out, and uh, see you guys in the next video.